Hi guys, welcome to Flash Fact. Today we're going to look at the classic Flash, the Flash of the Golden Age, the Jay Garrick Flash. Uh, essentially the new, the new Flash episode should start in, uh, in a few minutes. So let's take a quick look at how you can recreate Jay Garrick in DC Universe Online. Uh, for the longest time, uh, this is pretty much what you, you had to, to, to do in order to be able to recreate uh, Jay Garrick. You had to be lucky enough to get the, the Captain Marvel t-shirt from the vault. Uh, the electric pants is something that you do get uh, at character creation, so that's not a problem. And you had to either get lucky uh, to get the flash boots in the mission, or you had to buy them from the broker. And for the helmet, the closest thing we had until not too long ago was the biker helmet. That's, that's as close as you could get to Jay Garrick. But lately they added, uh, what's it called again? Oh, there it is. The combat helmet, which essentially is the same helmet without all the spikes. So for, for, for a bit, this was uh, as close as you could get. And I guess for many players, it's still it's still as close as you can get because essentially whatever you can, uh, the, the, the new gear that you can use to create a Jay Garrick is only available like at tier seven or something like that. So uh, other than, than, than the boots maybe. So essentially the boots are the flash boots that you can get. Uh, it's I think it's a tier two villain missions or you can get it from the broker if you're playing a hero character. Uh, the pants are ele the electric pants from the, the character creation. The t-shirt is the Captain Marvel t-shirt that you have to be lucky and get in the vault. There's no, no way around that. Uh, otherwise, you probably can get away with using uh, maybe the, the some slimline. Uh, let's see. Oh, let's go with this one. And let's go with the bolt, the lightning emblem. Oh, I went too far. I guess otherwise this is pretty much as close as you can get. Oh yeah, let's give him a belt. No belt. Well, let's see. No, I don't have the square buckle belt, or do I? Nope. Oh, it doesn't really matter. Oh, there we go. So this pretty much, uh, I guess this could do if you don't, you don't have the Captain Marvel T-shirt, and you have to be pretty lucky to get it from the vault. And the boots can be somewhat expensive; uh, they're pretty much at least a million, a million and a half, if not uh, two or three million, sometimes depending, I guess, on the demand. Uh, I guess lately with the the, the new styles that came out, uh, the boots are probably more in demand than before, so uh, it's, it's 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 probably a bit more expensive right now. But luckily, uh, we're going to need another character to be able to to take a look at uh, how you can create a much better version of uh, Jay Garrick. Let's get to it. So we'll use our Magneto character for that. So you can, this is pretty much, I think this is a much better version of, of Jay Garrick. Uh, sadly, the only way to create this look is to be tier seven and to be really like in the vault. Like, as you can see, I have the speed boots and the speed boots drop, I don't know, once in a, once in a blue moon or even less than that. But essentially, essentially if you can get the speed boots from the vault and, uh, and be really lucky, uh, then you're going to be able to use those boots. Uh, if not, you're going to have to use the, the flash boots. Uh, for the pants, again, the pants and the chest, there's no, no way around that. You have, you have to be tier seven and you have to purchase them uh, from the vendor. It's, it's pretty much that simple. Uh, I guess for the pants, you could probably go for the electric pants, I suppose. If it appears someday, there we go. I guess the, the electric pants could do the trick uh, as well. And obviously the chest is the shock chest, of course. 
and the helmet is the J. Garrick helmet that again you you need to to gather. Um, I think I'm not sure if it's investigations or briefing and the Flash, uh, the new Flash duo mission, the T, the Tier Seven uh, Flash Museum mission. So this is pretty much as close to J. Garrick as you will get. Although it's not quite J. Garrick, you it sells the idea well. Like the 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 chest piece. Looks not nothing really like it. Uh, doesn't really look like the J the the actual J Garrick uh, chest piece, but it sells the idea well enough. Like essentially a bright red suit with a big yellow lightning sells the idea of of the J Garrick uh, character. So that's pretty much it. Uh, that was flash fight for today. So if you want to create a, a J Garrick character. Uh, you, you're going. You're you're gonna have sadly to level up your character up to tier seven, and only then will you be able to to try to recreate uh, what I think is a pretty awesome look. So that's it for now. So hopefully I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.